welcome to the show. Today, Ricky is gone today, so to fill in, full, to fill in for him today, we got Dylan Shelley. <laughs> yeah, wave to the people. So today, we're going to be talking about the Fast and Furious movies. All right, Shelley, what do you think about these Fast and Furious movies? The Fast and Furious <laughs> series is a great movie series, okay? Mm -hmm. You cannot go wrong. From the first one to the new one they're coming out with. Uh -huh. they are just they're just all amazing. action packed and just Now, the only thing I have is the third one, Tokyo Drift, uh -huh. didn't tie in with the series until, what was it, the sixth or the seventh one? It was, the, it was one? The, the very end of the sixth one. It was the sixth one, <laughs> yes. Now, that's the only issue I had because when you watch one, two, and then three, and you get to Tokyo Drift, yeah, it has nothing, nothing to do, to do. You, with the first two yeah, you haven't and the next introduced, two. Yeah, you haven't even introduced Han yet to care about him. So. Exactly. He's like, what's going on here? I mean, it was a it great was a movie. movie but it was a still, great movie. Like, I think they could have like made it tie in better. But they tied it in good at the end. But At the end, but like previously they could have yeah. had him show up. Yeah, I was still kind of weird. But it was a great movie. Yeah, great great drift battle at the, at the end there. <laughs> that was epic. It was, it was awesome. <laughs> And the fifth movie, Fast Five. I think that might be my personal that favorite. That one is up there on the personal favorite list. Uh -huh. Just the end scene when they're driving with the safe in the back. Yes. It's just you, awesome. That is odd. They're tearing uh -huh. through that town <laughs> with the safe pulled by cars. That is insane. Yes. And that, that, who, th who thinks of that? Right? It's like, yeah. And that switch they do. <laughs> When they carve out that 10 second window with the garbage truck, uh -huh. they pull the safe into the garbage truck <laughs> that was like, and takes a new one that's, that's empty. Awesome. Like, <laughs> you don't even know it watching it until they go back and show it. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's, it's it makes sense because it shows them when they go from the bridge and it's, you see the garbage they, they truck, but you don't know truck, it. But they don't, you don't see them. Yeah, you don't see off. them switch it. <laughs> By far the best. Now, I will say, I do like 6 and 7, probably more than 5. But that's yeah. just because. I think six is better. great, except like like the one thing that kind of bugs me is the runway at the end. Yeah, because it's, it's a like long a 20, runway. It's like a twenty minute scene. That's there's a long like, runway. There's no way a runway is that long. That's a long runway. <laughs> Especially at the speed they're traveling. Yes, they're hauling. And especially even when they get out there, the runway is all you're they're already. They're already gone. Yeah, they're, they're already, already down halfway the down the runway. Wow. But no, they're not. You've got a 20 minute runway here, you can go. <laughs> now the only thing I don't like with that one at the end of that runway there is when that girl falls off. You know oh, she did. Yeah. You know she did. Uh, I know. What's that. her name? Giselle. Giselle. Giselle or whatever? Yeah. Well, that that was Han's scene. woman friend. Now you can't kill her off. Yeah, what I know. the heck? Uh-huh. This it is a, drunk. I don't like that. A, I don't like that either. It's just, it was a really emotional scene. Exactly. <laughs> But like that doesn't even compare to Furious Seven with the end how they the tribute to Paul Walker though. It's yeah. like no, that's... you can tell it's like everyone in the theater just fighting back the tears from oh, the man. So. I still fight back the tears, uh -huh. right? Every time I watch Paul Walker it was my man. <laughs> yeah, just every scene every scene if you've seen the movies, every you know every scene that they showed in his tribute. It yeah. was just it, awesome. He's just Paul was my man. <laughs> so sad to see him go. Mm hmm that's why I'm kind of curious about how the new one's going to be. I still think it's going to be good. Yeah, it'll be I good. I just want to see how they do without Paul Walker because he was like, for most people. He was for basically the most movie. People, yeah. Him and Vin. It was like him, the him interaction. And yeah. Him and Vin. With, with, in the first episode, Paul being a cop. And then the next movie, him not being a cop. Mm -hmm. And then the next one was Tokyo Drift. <laughs> then the fourth one, he was back at being a cop again. Mm -hmm. But then came <laughs> off to not being I a cop. Love, I love the ending of that. It's <laughs> crazy. Aw. Uh, I don't know how this fat, fat and furious, the fate of the furious is going to be since they got uh, Dominic being like a bad guy. Yeah, I don't know. So, I don't know. I don't, I, I don't know what the, I don't know what happened there to make him do that, but I'm guessing I think I'm guessing he's doing world. it. I'm guessing he's doing it for to protect like Letty and yeah, uh, all it, those it guys. just wouldn't make sense if he it did. It wouldn't make sense if that wasn't he, he, has, he has some sort of reason. He has reason because the, his number one thing is family. Uh-huh. They established that in the first uh, in the yeah. first seven movies. Yeah, not gonna go back. He's all that. about family, so he's got to be protecting him. Uh, like I seen a scene in the trailer, or whatever. He's standing there. And Letty's talking to him. Yeah, and she's like, "You won't shoot me because you love me." And then mm -hmm. he shoots, then he but shoots you don't know like if he shot her yeah. or something. <laughs> so I just have to wait for the movie. Uh huh. I think they're gonna do something kind of like. Letty in the sixth uh, one, except they're yeah, just gonna change yeah, it up a little bit. You know, except, I mean? yeah, he's not gonna like be 
like no memory. Uh -huh. But yeah. Yeah, that's about it. I think those, that's about those, it. those are some. That's a great series. Mm -hmm. Now, if you want to get from those are action movies. So if you want to get from an action one to a good emotional roller coaster movie, <laughs> check out Peach Dragon. I personally watched this the other day. Emotional roller coaster. Right? I was just thought in tears. It was. It was a sad movie. But I then it was happy. It but then it was happy. And then you get sad again. Movie. I haven't seen that movie yet. You so haven't? I'm gonna have to check that. You're out. gonna have to watch it. It's it's a good movie. I like it. I'll look into that. All right, I think that's about enough. I think we talked today. I think that's that's about enough. That's about got, what all we got. All right, now we're gonna kick it out to our investigative crew. See what they got, which is us. All right, after a couple weeks of trying to hunt down some leads, we finally got a, caught a break with one. So we got a new lead now. So it feels pretty good to finally catch one. Yeah, it does, especially after that dry streak we've been having for like three weeks. Yeah, we've had we've got nothing. We've had a pretty long streak of finding nothing, but we finally got mm -hmm. something, so. Yeah, we got some reports of them coming around. And that helps. So see if we can go out and find one. We're gonna go out and we're gonna go out and look for them again, and uh, hopefully we find them again and get get some yeah, better footage. We'll, yeah. Hopefully we don't get. Hopefully nothing happens like last time. Last time, remember, we snuck up on him having yeah, lunch. Yeah, and he, he got, got mad at us. Hopefully, yeah. we just keep at a safe hopefully, distance. Hopefully, try. everybody stays safe in this during this hunt right now. Yeah. Couldn't get a hold of Mr. White, otherwise we'd have him with us. Yeah, I don't he's know where he the, is. He's off the grid. He's off, yeah, he's off the grid. I just think, I think he's, out, he's, he's out hunting, though. That's why. Yeah, he's, he's got his bean bag gun with him ready to... He, he's, he's, he's out there. He's going to bag him one of these sap clutches. So, yeah, he's pretty determined to get one. He is. He wants to hang it up on his wall. Uh -huh. But yeah, so in other words, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go out. And we're gonna go on a hunt for them, and hope everybody stays safe and everybody returns home in one piece. Every time he returns home, good, and uh, hopefully we have ourselves a bigfoot. All right, that's our investigation for this week. Now we're gonna go out to uh, our weatherman out in the field, Cole Hansen. Hello, today I'm here for the weather. Cole Hansen. Today for the weather, it is a little bit chilly out. The wind is about five miles per hour. And right now, you can see that there is not much snow up. There still is in some spots, but it's still cold out. So I think that it will stay here for about another week. Then it'll start melting really good. And I think later on we'll have some slight rain coming tonight. So can't wait for that. Get some of the snow a little bit icy. It'll be icy, so be out. Be careful, folks. How is it slick? So. All right, I'm here with today. That's today's weather. Back to your shade. All right, thank you, Cole. Now, finally, at long last, Dante Irvin's gonna be on the show. Dante, come sit down now. Oh, thanks for having me on. Yeah, it's a pleasure to have you. All right, now you're finally on the show. Yeah. We've had a few things going on this week and stuff. Unfortunately, we're out of time right now, so... You're kidding. Yes, you're are you, are you're kidding on the show. I'm not kidding you. Look at the running time. We're at about 10 minutes now. This is garbage. You <laughs> invite me on the show boldly to kick me off? What, what is no, this? You, we, we got you on. We got you on. You're sitting here right now, aren't you? That is not what I meant. I will have... This is, this is going to be my episode. I want my own episode here. You know what I'm talking about? This is this is garbage. You invite me on, only tell me that we're done. <laughs> we're all we're. <laughs> what is it? Done? You can look at the type right there. I don't think we're done. You know what? I, this isn't the end of this, Sheena. <laughs> this isn't the end of this. I will be on. You hear me? You hear me? I guess you might be on. We'll try to get you on one of these days. Oh, <laughs> not Mike. You will. You will. You hear me? You hear me? All right, we'll see what we can do with that. <laughs> Good day to you, sir. Wow. 